So, off to a party tonight. My friend's celebrating her birthday, so we're going out for a few drinks. So this will be a fun. Check this out. It was bucketing it down about five minutes ago, and now the sun's cracking the flags outside. Crazy weather. It, the Highlands of Scotland is is nuts. It just changes like that. I'm going to see my friend, and we've been friends for about... What, five, six years now? Oh, wow, a long time anyway. And a few years ago, he moved into a flat, and this was after I lost my leg. And just tell me, what inconsiderate friend lives in a flat all the way up there when, when, when the friend has got one leg? I mean, obviously, I should have been the first thing he thought about when deciding to get a flat, never mind whether he could afford it or if it was in a good location. I mean, come on. First light done. I'm not doing it again. Pull the face. You're actually blinding me. I'm not recording, just do the face. Oh yeah, you're pointing your phone at you for no reason. Yeah. I just, I just like, I just... Zooming in yeah, and zooming out. <laughs> Xbox time. I like the little Yoda. Yeah. Have you seen the trailer? Have oh, you seen what? it? Oh. Right, I'm, re I'm stopping recording for a second. I was recording this to put a thing on saying nostalgia, but now I've all got, I've got is you singing to your dog. Go on, do it again, do it again. So, that's it. That's me back in at my pal's house. It's, uh, I think it's about ten past four in the morning. I'm so tired. And I think, yeah. Cause I'm gonna watch Doctor Who. <clears throat> yeah. yeah, so I was out last night, um, which meant I missed the season premiere of Doctor Who. And I hope my friend, well, no, I, I made sure my friend realised just how important the friendship is to me that I would go out to her birthday and miss the first episode of Doctor Who. Um, but now I'm home and I'm gonna go and watch it and I will. I'm not a I'm not a review show. That's not what I'm here to do. But I will give my my opinion on the show, which will almost certainly be positive, because I've been a fan for well since before even Christopher Eccleston. Because I remember seeing the Paul McGann movie when I was really really young, and I have loved it since. So yeah, even if it's crap, I will still probably say good things about it. <laughs> Playing a game I do not know of. Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. To try and summon a character I have never heard of. Who Black Rose form. Oh, we got Rainbow. Oh, we got Rainbow. Oh, we got Super Saiyan though. Oh, I got Super, Super Saiyan. Saiyan Bloody Super, Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan 2. Zang Zang Yo. Ooh. Mercenary Kai. Ooh. Ginyu. Ooh. Imperfect Self. Ooh. Majin Buu. Ooh. Hundred eighteen. I can't go any higher, man. Ooh. Oh, that's not the bully I want. No! Oh, damn it. Come on. Goku Black. This doesn't... Oh, I didn't get it. Ah! Bullshit! Bullshit. <laughs> this is my friend Matthew, by the way. Say hi, Matthew. Hi. He's not happy. He's not happy. Do it. Too far. Doctor Who was amazing. Yeah, That's my the review that I said I was going to do, by the way. It was amazing. It wasn't crap. It was brilliant. And the coming scene sequence was the best thing.
So you'll have seen in this video that I've been driving around a bit and that's another question I sometimes get. People wonder because I've lost my leg how I managed to drive and if I use an adapted car or not. I actually use a regular automatic and just cross my left leg over to press on the pedals. I will either move my right leg out of the way or take it off entirely which is the far more comfortable option. Um, because I never learned to drive beforehand, it wasn't too difficult to get used to using my left foot, though because of the unusual angle it does get quite painful on some of the longer journeys. Being able to drive is a godsend. The nearest bus stop to our house is over a mile away and it's all up and down hills, so if I couldn't drive I'd be stuck in the house pretty much all the time. As it is, I can go out, I can see friends, I can do things and just generally not go crazy from cabin fever. <laughs> More bearded up this time around. It's been a few days. <laughs>